what is that feeling you know of being the first uh, you know the first female racer uh, in uh, to win in the for me it was always not about you know being the first female racer or you know being the youngest female racer uh, i always believe that once the helmet is on you know uh, nobody knows what gender is driving the car even the car itself doesn't know if it's a guy driving or if it's a girl driving right uh, it's just a skill that matters right now uh, when we are in the car when we are driving it and the, all the hard work that matters so uh, obviously being in india a country where you know there are so many um, misconceptions about female and driving and even in general about women doing unconventional things uh when i started racing obviously people never really supported me saying that oh she's a girl how can she drive um uh, but now i ha- i have seen people accepting the fact that you know it's all about skill and uh now there are so many more girls coming in so for me being the youngest or the first female racer was obviously a boost to my confidence that okay you know i have got this opportunity where i'm being the first one to start something new in the country and start to spread the awareness about it but most importantly my only focus has always been that i want to be the best racer or at least i want to keep winning races that is the title that i would always you know have in my mind that that is my goal so luckily uh, you know i've got so much support from everybody and i became the first indian female to race in the jk euro series in 2017 and after that first indian female to actually race uh, and win internationally as well uh, so these are just like few more you know titles that i have achieved but there are a lot more goals which in which the the gender doesn't really matter so yeah awesome so i think the training is an ongoing process right yes till yes you, uh, right uh, so the training obviously uh, when i initially started i need a lot of, i needed a lot of practice to understand the car and how everything works out and uh, as i said skill we have to keep improving skill and skill is the main thing over there so i used to practice every weekend uh, because i have a small go karting track uh but after a point when i grew up and i went into higher categories uh i can't really drive on this track anymore and the cars that i'm currently driving they are they come from europe uh, just for the racing season and even okay. the other cars that uh, are available in india for us to practice uh, it's all in south india so yeah. traveling from gujarat and going every weekend it's super expensive renting the whole track and car so uh now what i have been uh, doing is on even others have been doing is just practicing on the simulator that we have at at home and then just wo- uh, focusing on our uh, you know fitness because uh, fitness is really important when it comes to formula cars or even in general for racing uh, so when i'm at home i'm always uh, focused on training myself physically and mentally and practicing on the simulator and once uh, we have our race weekends coming up we go a few days prior to the race weekend and we do a little testing out there maybe thursday friday and then we have our races on saturday sunday 